Well, good afternoon to you and welcome to our continuing highlight coverage of the 25th African Cup of Nations. And thanks for being with us. The group stages are over and we now move on to the quarterfinals. If you thought the group stages were exciting, which on the whole they were, the quarters promise even more. This afternoon's match, for example, between Guinea and Senegal has the potential to be a real cracker as both teams have displayed some pretty classy performances in their respective group stages. Guinea go into the match with no injury worries and hoping to pull it off against rival Senegal. The Senegalese may have to do without the services of El Hadji Diouf, who cut short training yesterday with a limp. Defender Habib Bay definitely won't start. He's on a four-match suspension for his stupid red card, which he picked up from the ref for his contribution to a squabble with Ghana's Larry Kingston. Who will make it through to the semis next Tuesday? Will it be Guinea or Senegal? Who will then face host Egypt or the DRC? Your guess is as good as mine as no team has a built-in qualifying device and we've seen a few slip-ups and surprises so far in this tournament. South Africa goalless and out, the Zimbabwe written off and then almost through after a dazzling display against Ghana, who they shot out of the contest. Now, without further ado, put the kettle on, get the chewing gum out, and let's get down to some serious football. Guinea in the red and yellow strip this afternoon. No, not those people you can see there. They're the fans. And the Senegalese in white. The referee is Kofi Koya, one of Africa's top men in black. And we're off. Senegal with the first chance here in the second minute of the game. Senegal on the ball here. Oh, keeper Diasso has his first scare. Henri Camara tries his luck from an angle on the right flank, a good early warm-up to this quarter-final clash between two teams who've got what it takes. Watch that one again. Nice warning shot there at the very beginning of the match. And Senegal are back on the ball again. Whoops. Henri Camara fouled there, sandwiched. And ref Kojia awards a free kick. Well, I certainly got off to a good start this match. Plenty of action. Both teams obviously wanting to win this game tonight. Whoever loses is out of the contest, of course. Henri Camera there being sandwiched. And now we get to see the ensuing free kick. Diasso there sorting out his wall. Camera getting ready to take it. Camera, it's a good ball! But that was too close for comfort. Danger away there. Diasso wise to it though. Boring is one word we probably won't have to use to describe this match if things carry on like this. So we've got Guinea this time around. Guinea on the ball here. Nice bit of work there, Guinea. Pascal Finduno, cross to Diawara. He heads, but can't get it across. The ball just goes wide, but the apparent underdogs are coming on strong this afternoon. Finduna and Diawara in great form. Nice bit of work there. Just wasn't enough, though. No goals as yet, 10 minutes into the match. A bit further on the line now, 15 minutes, Guinea. Guinea still on the ball. Oh, that's nice. It's, oh! Kaba Diawari's got it wide. The 1-0 seems to get closer by the minute. And it's Guinea with a better game play this afternoon. Well, at the moment, at any rate, Kaba Diawara with a hard header from a couple of yards out. Tony Silva was awake, but Diawara heads the ball wide. Still goalless at the moment. Guinea still. Guinea on the ball again. It's Diawara again. It's in. Collie couldn't do anything about the situation. Diawara omnipresent in the Senegal area. Shoots. The ball is in the net, but it has been declared offside. He had all the trappings of a welcome goal. But as you can see here in these pictures, in our replay, offside. What a mistake! What's Tony Silva doing? What a blunder! Diawara's there! He's there! It's 1 0! 1 0 for Guinea! Kaba Diawara doesn't just look dangerous, he is dangerous! 
We have our first goal of the evening. First goal of the quarters. Great stuff. That gets the game off to a flying start. Just take a look at Silver's mistake now. Oh, God. Two mistakes. They're two blunders. He gets it all wrong. Diawara says thanks. Strolls through the area from the left and casually pops the ball in. 1-0. Well deserved. Guinea with more ball contact. They're quicker in midfield. The brighter side at the moment. Guinea again. Oh, look at that. Mansouray flying down the wing. Gets past Colley with a brilliant lunge forward. A great solo. Oh, that could have been it. They could have taken their tally up there. Tony Silver was summing up the options. Fordy Mansari on his own. Shoots, but it's well wide. Great solo effort from Mansari. He could have made more out of that. He was one on one with Tony Silver there. Coley with hamstring problems, though. He has to be substituted after this. We've got Senegal back on the ball now. Oh, good run here from Diamanza Kamara. Oh, yes, for a string of Guinean defenders. Coming up the left, half left shoots, but unlucky not to score here. Sends the ball wide at the long corner. Senegal not selling out in this game. If they keep this up, we could see an equaliser very soon. Don't forget, a draw would be a game extension, could even lead to a penalty shootout. And that's it for the first half. That was great stuff. That was an entertaining match so far. Equal ball possession, loads of chances on both sides but a lot of scrappy passing in the first 45 minutes. Hope they get that sorted out in the second half. And we are here back in, in, the, in the second half now. Senegal chasing the equaliser. Oh, this has to be it now. Oh, it's visual Babel here in the area. Diasso, what's he doing? He's out of his box, the entire Guinean defence on the line. Everyone gets a try at that one. It won't go in though. Diasso can jump on the ball and prevent the very worst from happening. Just what was he doing there? That was he thinking of. Senegal back on the ball. They've lost it. They got it back again. Still Senegal on the ball. Still Senegal. Cross here. Demands the camera. Javi can't do anything without Papa Dupe. And it's a goal. It's in. We have the equaliser. Papa Boba Dupe, the Fulham man, levels the score. One all. Newman Yang, the number eight, subbing for Suleimani Kamara, just minutes in on the pitch, worries Guinea a bit there, and the equaliser is on the books. This will bring some excitement back into the game. Buba Dupe has the better of Nabi Diasso this time round. Beautiful goal there. All the fans are enjoying this. Nice sunny day here in Alexandria. Lovely cross, beautiful header. Hababubaju, he has the goal on his head. So we've got a free kick situation coming up here. So who's going to take the free kick? find out in just a moment. Is it going to be Diamancy? No, he leaves it. Brandy Faye. Oh! That could have been the next goal of the evening. Senegal definitely putting out the pressure now. A whole head of steam. And Senegal have got the ball back again. Oh! What's happening there? Oh, Bodhi gets it all wrong there. Nyang! It's a goal! It's there, Senegal going to the lead! A great missile of a shot from substitute Nyang. Bodhi with a big mistake. Nabid Yasso with a nightmare afternoon. 
Yasso does just as badly as Bobo Baldi commits a horrible mistake here. We'll be able to have a good look at it on the replay. Two one. Here's the ball across, and there's Nyang just waiting there, saying, Here I am, let me have a go. And bang, it's in the back of the net. Oh, but uh, Boba Baldi, big mistake there. Scotland's player of the year in 2003, he was. He's blundered today, leads to 2 1 for Senegal. Guinea led for a long time. Senegal have turned it all around with just 10 minutes to go. And we have Senegal on the ball again. Rui Camara, Camara, Camara! It's a goal! We have our winner, Henri Camara. Yang slides in and tries. Can't get to it. Diasso's in front of him. The ball was still live. Diasso was here, there and everywhere. Except there where Henri Camara was. And it's 3-1. Guinea must be out of the tournament now, surely. They can't pull that one back. 3-1. We've seen four goals this evening so far. Well, five actually. One of them disallowed, but uh, we've got four regular goals. Oh, it's nearly all over now, though. We're well into extra time. I can't see anybody pulling that scoreline back. Yang there with a the try. <laughs> And now we actually have a free kick for Guinea. Looks like Feinduno is going to take it. Will this make the difference? I hardly believe it. Feinduno. Oh, it's in! Feinduno pulls one back. 3-2. Pascal Feinduno scores four minutes into extra time. But it must be all over. Surely Giddy can't make it in the remaining seconds. He can't believe it either. Lovely goal. Pascal Finduno showing what he can do. But it must be all over now. It must be. And... Setting almost in there with another chance. Guinea on the ball. Senegal got the ball back. Guinea with the ball again. But that's the whistle. It's all over. That's it. Guinea is out of the contest. Senegal goes through to the semis. What looked like a one-all draw, game extension and even penalties ends up with a 3-2 scoreline with a memorable last 10 minutes. Senegal will go through and will face either the DRC or our host, the Pharaohs from Egypt. We'll know who in a couple of hours. Thanks for looking in. Bye.